Okay, so let's solve another MTOP reviewer. Okay, um, our topic is about number problem. Okay, so magbibigay ako ng isang example kung paano mag-solve ng number problem. Okay, ito yung isang sample problem. Find 5 consecutive odd integers whose sum is 55. Pag sinabi natin consecutive, magkakasunod. Or magkakasunod-sunod. So, when we say odd integers, ito yung mga numbers na 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, and so on. So, yun yung mga example ng odd integers. So, ang tinatanong dito is, hahanapin natin kung ano yung 5 consecutive odd integers na pag pinag-add mo, the answer is 55. Okay, so ito yung solution. Let x be the first odd integers. Um, be the second integer is x plus 2. Bakit siya x plus 2? So, let's say for example, yung x is 1. Pag nag-add ka ng 2, 1 plus 2 is 3. So, yun yung susunod na um, odd integers. Okay, para sa third odd integers is x plus 4. Bakit x plus 4? Um, if x is 1, pag nag-add ka ng 4, the answer is 5. So, mayroon na tayo yung 1, 3, 5. Okay, para sa fourth integer, mag a tayo ng 6. Because if x is 1, 1 plus 6, the answer is 7. So, 1, 3, 5, 7. Okay, para sa fifth odd integers, pang lima, okay, mag a tayo ng 8. Bakit 8? x plus uh, for example, x is 1, so 1 plus 8 equals 9. So, therefore, uh, if kung ang x natin ay 1, so ang first integer natin is 1. Um, second integer is 3. Third odd integer is uh, 5. Then, fourth odd integer is 7. And fifth odd integer is 9. Okay. Pero, dapat, pag pinag-add natin yung um, integers, yung odd integers from the first to fifth odd integers, kailangan, ang sum niya is 55. Okay, so, ang gagawin natin, pagsasamasamahin natin yung mga um, expression ng first integers to fifth integers. So, our first integers is x. Uh, first odd integers is x and then our se second odd integers is x plus 2 and third odd integers is x plus 4 and fourth odd integers is x plus 6 and the fifth odd integers is x plus 8 and then it equals natin sa 55 and then the next we're going to combine like terms pagsasamasamahin natin or i-add natin lahat ng x so, x plus x plus x plus x plus x. Okay, the answer is 5x plus 20. Bakit 20? Because 2 plus 4 is 6 plus 6 is 12 plus 8 is 20. Then, it is equal to 55. Then, now we have new equation 5x plus 20 equals 55. And then, to eliminate 20 and solve for, to solve for x, we're going to eliminate 20. So, in order to eliminate, we're going to apply the addition property of equality. Okay, mag a tayo ng negative 20 both side. Okay, so 20 minus 20 is 0. So, wala na. So, 5x na lang yung natira. It is equal to 55 plus negative 20. The answer is 35. And then, to solve for x, we're going to divide both side by 5. So, 5 divided by 5 is 1 or we can cancel 5. And then, 35 divided by 5 equals 7. So, therefore, the value of x is 7. Okay. Yung value ng 7, yun yung isa substitute natin doon sa, um, sa x. Okay. So, the first integer is x. Therefore, 
answer is 7. And then the second integer, odd integer is x plus 2. Substitute 7. Papalitan natin ng 7 yung x. Kaya 7 plus 2 equals 9. Then sa third odd integers, okay, we have 7 plus 4 equals 11. Then sa fourth odd integers, we have 7 plus 6 equals 13. Then, for the fifth odd integers, we have 7 plus 8 equals 15. So, we have now 5 integers, or we have the 5 consecutive odd integers. 7, 9, 11, 13, and 15. So, we can check that the answers are correct if we observe that the sum of these integers is 55 as required by the, by the problem. So, 7 plus 9 plus 11 plus 13 plus 15 equals 55.